My mission is to educate people, to bring about the conversations, because when you don't know, and it's based on fear, because people, superstition or ignorance is explanations based on fear, and which is the opposite of science, is based on fact or experimentation, you know, or dialogue, communication, whatever you want to call it, but it's based on actual fact and knowledge and respect. Once people find out, or once someone knows, or you know, you're transgender, all of a sudden, or you're transsexual, all of a sudden you're no longer human. Your education does not matter. Your background doesn't matter. All they see is that, you know, you're just, all of a sudden, all you become is, you know, a poster child for trans identity. And that does not, and then, then you're open, you're vulnerable to whatever their uh, opinions, hatred, or actions may be. And also people need to, understand, need to understand that if you want democracy in Haiti or anywhere else, it democracy is government by the people for the people, and it needs inclusion. It's not a matter I just want to just wear uh, the opposite sex clothes, but if I studied for 20 years and I had a title, I had a degree, I had a past, I need to be able to use that, I need to be able to continue. We're non-people where we have no identities, because if I couldn't change, look at me looking like this and having a document that says John Smith, I wouldn't be able to navigate, I can't go to Western Union. Basic things, opening a bank account. So the thing is, we're not trying to fool or hide or deceive anyone. That's one of the perceptions that, you know, that, that causes all the confusion because they think like, you know, we're mimicking someone. Or you wake up one day, there's nothing on TV, I'm bored. Hmm, let me go <laughs> from male to female. No, that's not what it is. <laughs> there's a difference between being male and being a man, between being female and being a woman. Being Sex is just, you know, the physical, the biology, the physiology is just to reproduce. But your identity, your gender, whether you're a man or woman, that's between your ears, not between your legs. <laughs>